I did see my father today. I tried entering this hospital. However, the authorities have had locked the doors. They were not allowing me in. They were not allowing patients to come in or patients to come out. And I feel like this was a grave injustice not only for the other patients in the hospital. And they manhandled me. They did not allow me to see my father yet. The women police also tried to stop me from seeing my father. I, my father saw me. He took, he struggled to get out of his wheelchair, took my hand and let me see, brought me into his room to see him. The police officers multiple times came in saying, Bibi, get out, leave, leave. And I refused to, I have a court order with me, giving me permission to see my father today. And they said that the jail authorities are not here. So either they have declared it a sub jail or they haven't declared it a sub jail. The authorities are not here for any of us to speak to. They have denied his lawyers to speak to him and he has not been able to see his lawyers or his family members. After a few minutes only, they had asked me to also leave. They tried to stop me. I was waiting for my father to complete his tests. That he was doing some tests today. They want to do some more tests tomorrow. <laughs> ये जो अस्पताल है ये पब्लिक प्लेस है आप किसी को अंदर आने से नहीं रोक सकते जब तक ये पूरे पब्लिक हॉस्पिटल को ये जेल डिक्लेअर कर दें फिर आप किसी को अंदर आना नहीं अगर उन्होंने एक कमरे को डिक्लेयर किया सब जेल जिसका हमें इलम नहीं है उस कमरे में कोई नहीं जा सकता मगर एक्सेस जो है हॉस्पिटल की किसी को रोका नहीं जा सकता और एक मरीज के साथ जो तो उनको बेटी से भी ना मिलना जाए इससे बड़ी लाकानूत इस मुल्क के अंदर नहीं हो सकती ना सोशल कमिश्नर ले रहे थे ना पुलिस वाले ले रहे थे ना जेल अथॉरिटीज में अवेलेबल थे हम चाहते थे कि हमारी इस पटिशन पर ऑर्डर करें या तो हमें जाने की इजाज़त है या रिफ्यूज़ करें लेकिन यहाँ पे कोई जेल अथॉरिटीज़ नहीं थी ये तो अधेर नगरी बची हुई है एक बच्ची को अपने वालद से नहीं मिलने दिया जा रहा जो बीमार है इस किस्म का जुल्म और बरबीत कब तक चलेगी